Life to Bag is an integrated information and awareness campaign for the reduction of plastic bags in the marine environment. The project began in September 2015 and was completed in January 2019 with a pilot area, the island of Syros. Η Σύρος νίκησε την εξάρτησή της από την πλαστική σακούλα στο πλαίσιο ευρωπαϊκού προγράμματος Life to Bag. During the project, an intensive information campaign for the citizens of the island was implemented with a campaign on a national level throughout Greece. To inform and raise awareness in Syros, Life to Bag established the Plastic Bag Free Week, in effect since 2016. A celebration of the environment where every year in May, events and information campaigns on this issue took place. Musical events, educational games, exhibitions by school students and students of the University of the Aegean were combined with important lectures by scientists and distinguished guests such as Dr. François Galgani, head of the European Group supporting the Marine Strategy Framework Directive for the monitoring of marine litter. At the same time, a door-to-door -door information campaign was carried out in all the households and shops of Syros, while in hotels and room rentals, information material was permanently placed. Since information alone is not enough to kick an old habit, about 12,000 durable cotton reusable carrier bags were offered for free to residents and visitors in Syros as an alternative to single-use plastic bags. In the schools of Syros, educational presentations on the plastic bag issue and teacher training seminars were held. The environmental education program was not limited to Syros. More than four and a half thousand students took part in Syros, Paros, Naxos, Mykonos, Attica, and Thessaloniki. This training material is still available at the Life to Bag website. The Life to Bag team coordinated a series of consultation forums in Greece with the Ministry of Environment and Energy and the Hellenic Recycling Agency. Among others, Greek plastic importers and manufacturers, supermarket chains, the Research Institute of Retail Consumer Goods, and non-profit organizations all participated in the forums. These consultations led to the drafting of life to bag proposals, which were submitted to the relevant legislative bodies and were presented to the Special Permanent Committee on Environmental Protection of the Hellenic Parliament. Έχει ήδη ανακοινωθεί από το ΙΠΕΝ ότι θα προχωρήσει άμεσα σε νομοθετική ρύθμιση ευρωπαϊκή οδηγία για τη μείωση τη χρήση πλαστική σακούλα. As a result, Life to Bag contributed to the legislation that took force in Greece on January 1, 2017, for the reduction of lightweight plastic bags. Η Ελλάδα ήταν μία από τις τελευταίες χώρες της Ευρώπης που έθεσε σε εφαρμογή το μέτρο τη χρέωση 4 λεπτά του ευρώ, εν είδη περιβαλλοντικού προστίμου. In an effort to assess the effectiveness of life to bag on the island of Syros, intensive research into the marine environment and consumer habits was carried out for the first time in an information and awareness program. The residents of Syros also participated in surveys. At the same time, along select portions of the island's coastline, systematic research on the marine litter load especially plastic bags, was carried out. Aerial monitoring by drones was used to develop new methodologies for monitoring the presence of marine litter on remote coasts. Research also extended to the seabed. 1,000 acres were systematically surveyed with underwater cameras and remote-controlled underwater vehicles. In addition, the seabed was surveyed using sonar and autonomous surface vehicles for the identification of possible natural litter traps. Litter in the marine environment of Syros, however, does not only originate from the island itself. A recent study, carried out with the support of Life to Bag, has shown that much floating debris travels from the Dardanelles and North Aegean Sea all the way to the Ionian Sea. This research showed us that marine litter knows no boundaries. 
In total, more than 60,000 pieces of litter were collected and studied. During Life to Bag, plastic bag litter was significantly reduced, reaching an impressive 85% reduction by the end of the project. A similar decrease of 67% was recorded in plastic bag consumption by the citizens of Syros. The news from the seabed of Syros is impressive. After three years of underwater monitoring, there was a 60% reduction in the plastic bags found resting on the seabed around the island. 215 shop owners in Syros have pledged to voluntarily reduce single-use plastic bags, while the number of retail professionals producing their own reusable bags is growing. Finally, at the Life to Bag closing workshop, five supermarket chains signed a voluntary agreement for the reduction of single-use plastic bags. In Greece, Life to Bag has inspired numerous initiatives to combat the use of plastic bags. It has shown us that an information campaign can bring significant improvements to the marine environment, provided that it includes free, reusable alternatives, intensive information for stakeholders and consumers, and their involvement in decision-making. The Plastic Bag Levy provides a model and incentive to further remove single-use plastics from our lives, to recycle, and to reduce the amount of garbage we produce, relieving the environment of an enormous, long-lasting burden.